Looks like we're nearly there. We're going into Gela the Baths. When it comes to beautiful places, Europe seems to have it covered. And it's done it pretty well. Take Paris or London, for example. Barcelona's Gaudi and Budapest's Art Nouveau. With its crazy beautiful Gellert Baths. Trust me on this one, you have never bathed in such extravagance before. And Gellert Baths feels like the quintessential part of your travel package. But more importantly, how do you get there? Gellert Baths is located near Gellert Hill, just by the Liberty Bridge on the Buddha side. Public transport? We actually walked there, it helped that our place was in quite a central location, otherwise, Catch tram number 47 or 49 from Deke Ferrance. It's also easily accessible by bus or metro. Right, so now we're heading to the top of this hill. Um, do you remember the name of it? It was, uh, I think, Saint Gerard of the Cas uh, Sandy? The Samba, I think. <laughs> oh. It's one of the less known spots, uh, but okay. it offers really beautiful views. Beautiful free views as well. So free views, yes. So with St Stephen's Basilica, the views were amazing from the top. But for anyone who's on like a budget, really, that costs a thousand four in each to That's get to the top. Quite cheap. It's still, still quite cheap, cheap. But this one's for, uh, for free. So if you just want any views from the top and you're in a hurry, then maybe this one might be a better option because it's a bit busier. And it's on the way to get up the hill. Uh, Yes, so I believe we're going so, yeah. To Baths. Yes, it is on the way and that's there. That's just a little diversion in a way. And stop here for some of the best panoramic views of Pesk from the Buddha side. Did you climb up there from down here? I can, I just wonder how you done it. Little did we know at the time that the statue of St. Gerard happens to be the patron and ultimately the person behind the name Gerdet Hill and Gerdet Hotel. Back in the 11th century, he travelled from Venice to share Christianity. The pagan Hungarians didn't like it, so they put him in a barrel and threw him off that hill. Now he watches over from up here. Gellert Bus is a state-of-the-art spa you'll hardly find rivalry for. As soon as you're in, it feels like you've gone back in time, greeted by the old-fashioned glam in Gatsby style. Flirtatious and sensual goddess statues all around. Huge chandeliers with dazzling crystals, scarlet red curtains, a bit like a vintage-style cinema. And last but not least, artistic stained glass windows in the roof of the dome. The baths are even more lavishly decorated. Just wait. need to tell you that this place seems like a perfect spot for a date if you fancy a bit of pampering. There is more to Budapest Spa than Seicheni which we totally recommend by the way. You can check out our video from Seicheni here. Okay guys, are you ready? We're about to enter Gunner. Show a bit of swagger and class and treat him to Gunner, the spa palace, literally. These royal style baths would be the icing on your Budapest trip cake. The bar has been raised high. You see, we got spoiled during our few months of travelling around Japan and it was pretty difficult to match the Japanese spa experience which raised the bar even higher. Jackpot, good at spa seem to be the winner. The healing waters have been known in this area since the 13th century and often visited by the Turks, monks and even monarchs. Here is 
our absolutely favorite one, mosaic tiles, cherub fountains with chubby cheeks and azure blue water, all kept at a perfect temperature of over 30 degrees Celsius. One thing I know for sure, there is no way I'm coming out anytime soon. Perfect, it's not too overcrowded in here and you have plenty of space for yourself. With 10 swimming pools to choose from, treatment rooms and saunas, you'll find a place to chill and disconnect from it all. Rich in minerals, these magical healing springs are said to cure asthma, improve circulation and most importantly relax your body and mind. If anything, we felt too relaxed in here that we ended up staying for far too long. No stag dudes here, making it ideal for an undisturbed soak. When it comes to the pampering experience, Gerda has no rivals, including the ancient Roman baths in Bath, England. Sorry Bath, someone has finally had the courage to tell you that. Geothermal pools are much prettier on the inside. The outside is good but a bit colder. Outdoor wave pools and plunge pools seemed way too cold in April. But that's not all. Budapest is often compared to the Paris of the East for a reason. To top it all off, we're having an exclusive dinner in this medieval fairy tale castle, locked in a tower and dining by the moonlight like a prince and princess which is exactly where we're taking you in our next video. Remember to check out our other videos from Budapest and stay connected. Hit the like and subscribe button to see more videos from our adventures.